All right. Oh. I lost the last match. So I'm no longer one match Who off showed up. Diamond. <gasps> Are these two friends or Yeah, now I'm two matches off Diamond. Let's see how I do. Maybe I'll just be infinitely stuck in this loop of back and forth, back and forth. But in the last match I couldn't catch a break. Maybe I will this time. Chalet is one of my best maps. So that means I either do amazingly well on it or I get the shit fucked out of me. Mm. I'm probably going to push above into master bedroom, break open the floor like I normally do. We don't have a hard breacher for the hatch. So that sucks. But... I have been playing enough hard breachers lately, I want something else. I'll play Thermite when we go basement, because that's more of a necessity. Top floor isn't absolutely essential. Because if you just open up all of the floor into kitchen and dining room, then you can just jump in the window. Bathroom's clear. The person that was in trophy ran off. Woman. Hey, Sophia, can you get that bar for me? One in dining. Oh, upstairs vigil. We had three people upstairs, and how am I the one that gets punished for it? He was coming from the library. That is the story of my life. Three people upstairs, and then Vigil kills me. I guess everyone else had already gone downstairs, but I figured if they were up there for so long, I would be safe too. I think I'll do the normal Rook thing. It works so well. I know it's kind of boring to watch the same thing over and over again, but it is by far my favorite strategy and just has not failed me once. Some of these guys know each other. Got barricade off. Double. I like barricading both, but I don't know. Leave it. No, I'll barricade both. I like it because the first one's a warning to let us know that they're coming. Second one's like I can prepare and watch for where they're gonna break. Oh, I, uh, I almost got docked, so I left every single. Piece of Oh, okay, give me a sec. What? That got serious real quick. Well, Ripper teammates. Oh, we never got Hodge. Breaking to double door. 
unfortunate when you can't see your opponent. Right. Esports ready. They're droning you out, smoke. That's Sabana. Yeah, Zofia's still at hatch. Oh. Oh. Twitch is in diner. Twitch. Why didn't we? <laughs> Someone's gotta be watching that camera. One's master, one's dining. Oh. Drop hatch. All we needed was someone on that camera, and I would have known. Push into the dining. That sucks. Yeah, if someone had been watching, we had two people dead. One of them could have been watching the camera. Downey really called it out once I died. That sucks. Sludge will work, I just have to be ready to, like, grenade people out. This is why I want Hibana as my first DLC on. She's such a utility op and not overpowered, but just necessary. Which I really think they should introduce more hard breachers into the game. We need more variety when it comes to breachers, not just Hibana and Thermite. Because then the meta becomes pretty stale when you only have these two hard breachers and that's it. But I don't know really how you could change their gadgets into other alterations. You can maybe make like a sledgehammer that will break a hole in a wall but it can only be used twice. So Vigil's upstairs, I just don't know where. Got Bandit. someone else up here. Ben or Jaeger's upstairs by hatch. Fucking rip. Where was he? Oh, well, he was just close in the hallway the entire time. I thought he was closer to the fireplace. This is winnable. Should know that. Oh, I 
think he would have been better off faking the plant in a safer spot. He kind of chose in the middle of the room. He could like done it at the very end by the countertop. Mm. I could go Rook again, but somebody just needs someone to watch that camera. Fuck it. If it ain't broke, don't fix it. I would maybe go Jaeger or Bandit if we had less roamers. I'm assuming Vigil and Ella will roam, and then Legion might also roam. Smoke should stay the same. We actually get hatched this time. Yeah, we did. I only single barricade at this time. Don't think that'll make really a difference, but as soon as that one barricade breaks, I'm just watching that doorway nonstop. Should do that. Ooh. Four deaths in like two seconds. I can't see shit because of the white outline, but okay, thank god he moved. Our bond is above uh, double door. Are down. Oh. oh, he's on it. Nice. Okay, not necessary. At least back to even. Mm. 
What will we need? We need a Breacher. 100% of basement. We can't not have one. We have Hibana. Double Breacher is probably good, though. It sucks seeing the same operators all the time, but on this account, I am going for the win. By all accounts, we need the win. So, I'd rather go Thermite every single time and make sure we always win than to mix it up, try different operators, and then lose more often. That's what the main account's for. Oh, can you not? I guess that makes sense that you can't get inside that. What am I driving on? Hmm. Let me get up there. How the fuck do you get up there? Alright, whatever. One's a master bedroom. Trench is clear. We can't break the wall, they have a jammer on it. Mute's inside closet. Mirror's on the garage. Do you mean to burn the ADS? I got right side. Could he see me? You have one flash. Apparently, perfectly see my head. Oh, fucking rip. I honestly didn't think he could see my head. He could see my head, but I couldn't see, like, any of the mirror. Makes sense. <sighs> when the first person said... What are you doing, Ying? Hmm? What are you doing? He just ran in there. Yeah, I yinged it off. <laughs> but the guy in the closet was not Ying. Yeah, I know. Bugs me that the first person perspective in this game is so broken. You can see one person one way, but you can't see them the other way.
from the entrance. Both sides. I was afraid they were gonna push this wall. One's in trench. Crunch. I don't know what his plan was there. Well, I guess he was just gonna try to fake it, kill me, and then go for the full plan. Whew, okay. No more fucking around. Somebody else play Mira, please. We're going dining. Or are we gonna go basement? Basement. Basement. Alright. I don't have Mira. I just saw you choose her. I don't have her. I have no DLC ops. Someone else who chose her. I run right in front of Mira as soon as she's shotgun her. I should be doing this with an ACOG, but we need someone to hold blue. I got like stuck on the wall as I was trying to get up and it wouldn't let me and then I had to like fucking spam the move. But it worked out. We're good. Doesn't matter. Doesn't matter how shitty you are when you get the kill, it's the fact that you got a kill. At least that's what I taught myself at night. I don't know why this guy rushes every time. Well, not every time, but he's rushed twice. Both times we were ready.
Hmm. Last time I looked at this clock, it was... Or looked at a clock in the game, it was 10.05 on border. On this map, it's 10.11. Huh. I wonder if it actually changes based on the map. Or maybe I just never read the clock right in border. I think our team's getting really aggressive towards them. Oh, what a ragdoll. I couldn't even see what the fuck was happening there. Okay. I don't think Sledge has worked once for me up here, but... Actually, it's not true. Mm. It didn't work the first time I got killed by Vigil. What happened the second time? I got banded and then Jaeger killed me. I'm just going to push on this side instead. I'm just going to push straight for office. Usually office is much less defended than master bedroom. The only issue is uh, one way out. Or at least that balcony. If I can get on top of that balcony, I can get to master bedroom as well with the big window. No one's like spawn peaked at all in this game. It's a nice change. The last game I played had like 15 spawn peekers. What the fuck? Did you shoot me through the floor? There has to be a pulse, right? No? What? Just shot me through the floor. Oh my god, he's moving so much. Doc's just watching the kitchen window. There's no point in taking one or two shots because it's Doc. He's just going to heal himself. If you're going to go for Doc, you might as well go for the kill. Still not entirely sure how he shot me through the floor. What's main? What's main? What's main? What's main? What's main? Not down the stairs. Bandits upstairs fireplace. God damn it. I'm, I'm always the one that gets punished. Our teammate was up there the entire time and Bandit pushes me. Camera's still on you. Was that not a headshot? I feel like that was. But it's seed, so it probably just counted as a toe shot.
Alright. I was thinking of going someone to mix it up, but now we need to win it here. even but somehow we have like almost two less less deaths across the board we have a total of 28 deaths they have 34 and yet somehow we're even i guess oh i mean in the ones that you win they could have win a one only one person was left standing whereas we could win with all five still standing I guess it kind of makes sense. Oh, I think that's the first line of the entire game. I can't blame them. This is for all the marbles, so... care if they kill everyone because a win's a win right now. Rip. So let's sledge, twitch, lion, Sophia. We didn't break or reinforce hatch again. I'm pretty sure we've only reinforced hatch once, if even that. I like when people watch me and they make the calls for me because then I don't have to actually worry about it. It's actually really nice. The only thing is I wish they would also watch the cameras. West main. I think so. He's above the hatch. Hatch. Why did you... Oh, why were you just baiting your teammate? Why would you... Why would you peek that? Just wait. No, how about you crossfire that hatch drop where he can't shoot any of you? This is varsity gaming, chill out, he's a YouTuber. Who cares? This guy is so upset. Why would you, like, don't peek it. He has to drop. He has no choice but to drop. Back to one match off of Diamond. Not too bad. Yeah. Still, that guy's dumb. Don't peek a hatch, you don't have to. 